Howdy folks and welcome back to Let's Play Breath of Fire. Alright, we're going to have a lot of fun today because we are here in the town of the Forest Clan. These guys are a bunch of uh, demi-humans. They are uh, nanimals. And they have no water. The rock that blocks the river is much too big for us to move. Oh no! It's no good. Okay, so... Let's check all the houses to see if we can plunder their goods. Because that's what heroes do. They bust into people's houses and they steal their shit. Or stuff. Wow. Yeah. Oh, we got ourselves... Hey, we have an iron ore. Cool. Alright. We have a saw. Cool. Alright, so we have a saw. And... Okay, so we're gonna go over here into... The Tuntar Chief says, give up the treasure. That's not like him. Okay, well, let's get inside here and talk to the guy. Dark Dragons will give back our, our water back to us for our treasure. I don't want to give in, but the neighboring village is suffering too. That's no good. Oh, chest. We get a white, uh, wisdom potion. We chased our dark dragons into the Lament Woods until I was hit. Alright. Alright, so that's pretty much all, everything that we can do here. Um, let's, uh, let's take a trip over to the neighboring village right on the other side of the river there and see what's going on in their neck of the woods. Be nice if we could just, you know, like go across a little bridge in the town, but eh. Okay, these guys are all humans. This is Duntar. We call the, call the valley up north the Stone Cemetery. Well, I guess even rocks die. So, this is interesting. These guys have the item shop, but the other guys have the weapon shop. Well, they got a blacksmith here, too. Let's see. Nothing here. And nothing here. Let's see. Nothing here. And nothing here. Alright, so there's nothing inside any of these little huts. Let's go take a look. let's uh let's go have a little chat with the elder. I don't know how to work the robot and I don't want to get involved. Tentar should give up the ring and to resolve the problem. No! Now, there's one thing that's very interesting that I that I noticed um, maybe a year or two ago in this in this house here. Um, there's a map on a wall right here. Now, one of the lead developers for this game uh, in later times actually quit the console market and went to PC gaming. What do you see on the wall right there? It's a rough, early version of Azeroth. Yes, one of the lead developers for this game now develops World of Warcraft. And the entire Warcraft series. Which is, which is pretty cool, I think. Alright, so it looks like we have to go up here into the woods, which... Ooh, zombies! Zombies are, can be a pain because they can inflict the zombie status on you, which is right away right there. Now, it doesn't affect your damage output, or actually, maybe it does. Hold on. Yeah, it's it, apparently it does. Um. Yeah. It didn't used to, but I guess. They didn't in the SNES version. So, no, I don't want the map. No, I don't want the map! Go away! 
Jeez. Okay, let's... Do we have anything? Just an antidote. Body becomes fully healthy. Charm? Return to normal? Nope, no need. Nope, nope, that wasn't it. Um... Well, snap. Looks like we're going back to the town. Because... We need to get some stuff that'll undo the runaway... The, outer, the runaway st status. Oh, snap! Alright, now we just need something to bring our dude back to life. Actually, wait a second. I think... Oh, nope, nope, nope. This isn't the one where you come back to life after battle. Let's see. Cure. Teardrop. That's what it is. So we're going to grab 27 teardrops. All right, and then we are going to go over here to the inn. Because, uh, you know, I should have known. I should have known that it was going to do that. Should have known that was going to happen. That's okay, though, because we are heroes. And we have, we have and will do the impossible, and that makes us mighty. All right, so we had... Oh, flipping zombies again. All right. Yes, fail, fail. Dang. All right. Yes. Die again. True death. You will meet the true death. Need the levels up. But doesn't learn a spell. All right. Okay. And the forest is actually right here. A big tree blocks the road, and we use the saw to clear it. Because... We're a woodsman now. You overworked the saw and broke it. Aww. Awesome music in here. And the bones of our predecessors. And we have a skeletal rider. Now, same as every other Titan enemy, um, just have Nina use the E key. Have Ryu do a regular attack. I'm actually going to switch him to his sword here in a minute. Oh, excuse me. Yes, we're going to switch him to his sword. And, I don't know why I left the menu, because we're going to have Nina heal him. Alright. Going to continue our way through the forest, picking up treasure boxes, stepping on bones, collecting herbs, and killing zombies. We got ourselves a big mushroom guy there. Um, yeah, there, the E key is going to make, it pretty much breaks the, the early game. And, you know, it just, yeah, it just... I just realized I have not um, stopped my timer for any of these random battles. So, if for some reason 
that the video just cuts out with me without me saying goodbye. Oh, we got a big ol' we got a, a uh, ghost knight. I have a ghost knight here. Um, yeah, so if the video cuts out without me saying goodbye or anything like that, it's just because, you know, we're switching. It's it's just, I went over time. And I didn't know it because I, like an idiot, didn't, didn't set my timer. So I have no idea how much actual time is, is going to be cut off from editing. So I'm going to record probably about 20, 25 minutes. And that should be pretty straight. So we got our big penis monster. And we have a stone shack. What do we got here? Nobody gets past us! We're very sharp guards! Uh, yeah, because there's two of you in the doorway is only two people wide. Alright. These guards, they use his boss music, but they're not bosses. They're just, they're actually pretty lame. Okay, we're gonna have uh, Ryu use the E key, and we're gonna have Nina heal him. Next round, we'll have Nina heal herself. No, that's not what I wanted. Wow. Habit. Habit made me do that. All right. All right, now there are trapdoors. See where these bats are? Trapdoor! Now you definitely want to fall down one trapdoor at least once because you get treasures. And you get to walk around. Oh, I got a longsword. That's what she said. Longsword increases damage. Nice. Alright. And as you see, the trapdoor closes after we go through it, so... Basically, what you want to look out for is anything that has... Oh, what the heck is this? A midget! It's some midget. Oh, wow. Yes. You could remember back when politically correctness was not in any way, shape, or form an issue? Things were so much simpler, so much easier. You pretty much... You called people what they were. And nobody could get bad about it. It's a Zard. These lizard guys are pretty cool. That should be every new enemy here in this area. The lizard guys. Oh yes, uh, okay, so she learned Cure 2, which is very nice. Oh, trap door. Alright, so... I am going to be taking a little vacation here next couple days. Um, we're going to be hit, hit, taking a little family trip up north, so um, don't expect any videos to be up. This guy's a new guy here, a war, Warhog. Yeah, don't expect any any new videos until probably Sunday or Monday, because we get back on Sunday later in the evening. I'm going to have a video ready to go for the day I get back, but... Um, once, uh, when, when we're gone, there's not going to be anyone here. So, yeah. So there's going to be no one here to upload it for me. I mean, I could probably talk my sister-in-law into coming over and doing it, but, eh, I don't know if I trust her on my computer. My computer is, 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 um, needs, uh, to be a little gentle. You gotta be a little gentle with it lately, because she's been having some problems. And it's not like a virus or anything, so don't, don't tell me, er, turn off the porn, because no, just no. Uh, what it is is just simply that the thing is old. 
Yeah, so the computer, you know, it, it's just old, is, is all it is. And we're back, and like I was saying, uh, no virus or, or anything, uh, the computer's just, it's just old. Oh, trapdoor. Fifty points of damage. Ow. That hurt. <laughs> All right. So, continue on. Yes. Heart the maze of maziness, and its mazy goodness. Not corn maze. Yes. All right. Believe that we are almost done with this area. You can rescue the chief. Don't make me laugh. All right, and it, we've rescued the chief. But, wait a second, weren't both of the chiefs in the village? Thanks for saving me! Let's take their weapons before we leave! Do you want me to lead you to them? Yes. Follow me! Step in here while I open the secret passage. And we're trapped. Ah, they fell for that! They fell for it! That was easy! Pog will have a nice snack. Uh-oh. And we've got Pog! Pog is a two-headed beast thingy mabubber. And he's pretty simple. He doesn't really hit all that hard, but he does get two turn... two attacks per turn. Because he's got two heads, obviously. So, you know, same as everything else, you know, E key and regular attack. Have Nina heal when necessary. She'll probably be healing every, uh, every, every other turn or so. So you want to make sure you keep her alive. She's very important. Because if you lose her, you lose all of your, like, big healing capability. And Pog has been defeated. And right here is where we're going to end today's episode. Thank you very much for watching. This has been Mr. Ramsey B saying have a good afternoon and a good weekend. Be safe.